Hi everyone, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I'm really excited to be here with you today for this sponsored video from Walmart. And you know, some people think that sponsored videos, you know, can't be the honest opinion of the YouTuber. But in my case, I realized when they asked me to do this sponsored video that most of the products that I use on a daily basis in terms of makeup and skincare are from Walmart. And the name of this Walmart campaign is Here for Every Beauty. And I'm certainly thankful for that because they did ask me to participate. And I am not the normal 25 year old, 30 year old YouTuber. I am a 50 plus YouTuber, as I mentioned earlier, and I'm just so grateful that Walmart's all-inclusive idea of beauty does include us more mature beauties, and believe me, they have a wealth of wonderful anti-aging makeup and skincare. And Walmart has recently launched their Mindful Beauty campaign, and here it is, and it says fine brands and formulas you can really feel good about. And all of their makeup and skincare in the Mindful Beauty line is without sulfates, parabens, or phthalates. And I didn't know what phthalates were, I have to admit, and I looked it up, and phthalates are plastics. And I have to admit, the idea of having plastics in my makeup and skincare is something I really don't want. So I am really glad that Walmart has launched Mindful Beauty, and I'll put a link below, because when you shop those products, you can be assured you're getting natural products, products that are good for your skin, makeup and skincare you can truly feel good about. And another area of the new Walmart website that I really love is their dermatologist recommended area. And here is a look at that. It says Derm Recommended Brands. And actually I use two out of the four products right there on an ongoing basis. But I do like their dermatologist recommended brands because you can get high-end or drugstore, even Obagi, that type of product you can find on the Walmart dermatologist recommended site. Okay, I have a lot to show you today, so let's get into this. And most of the makeup I have on my face today, I'm going to be showing you because it is from Walmart. And I really like this look that I've created because recently we've all been sheltering at home more with the recent situation and turn of events. And I particularly like this makeup look that I've created because it is kind of a no makeup makeup look. I always like to feel like when I am sheltering at home, as we all are lately, I always like to feel like I do have makeup on that I look a little more polished because quite honestly, I'm afraid if I just get used to schlumping around every day with no shower or no makeup, I could live there and be very depressed and I don't want to do that. So makeup does perk me up and help me feel good about facing the day. Okay, now let me get into showing you some of my favorite Walmart products. Walmart said you can choose any products you want, so I'll be showing you my all-time favorites. The first is the foundation I have on right now. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation. And as you can see, it really does give you kind of a poreless look. And I don't use a lot of this. I just dab it all over my face, just maybe one dab here, one dab here, three dabs here. And how I applied it today was with a normal flat foundation brush, but I used a little bit of the e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set on the brush. I just gave it about three spritzes and then just used circular motions to blend this all in, brought it down on my neck a little bit, and as you can see, it just gives my skin tone an all over natural, very smooth finish. Love that. Now, another foundation that I've really been using and enjoying a lot lately during our sheltering in place days is this Rimmel Stay Matte Foundation in True Ivory. Truly love this one. It is a wonderful foundation for those days when you really hardly want to wear any makeup at all, but you just want it to look like you have beautiful natural skin. And here is a look at this. And again, my color is True Ivory, and it's a beautiful, beautiful color. But there that is. And it looks very much like the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation, except that it is perhaps a little bit lighter, a little bit more of a no makeup look. Now, something else we need when we're staying at home but still trying to look our best is a wonderful under eye concealer. And this is one of the best. And in fact, I did a video about this maybe about nine months ago in which I compared this Milani Conceal and Perfect Concealer with Tarte Shape Tape. And to me, this one wins. Absolutely love this. This is a very high coverage concealer. It really conceals everything under your eyes, and yet it doesn't look powder, it doesn't flake off, it wears all day, and it doesn't make your fine lines and wrinkles look worse, because obviously at my age I have them. Absolutely love this Milani Conceal in Perfect. 
Now let's get into eyes and I have some really exciting things to show you. The first is this brand that I discovered about six months ago when I was in the Walmart store. And this is the Perfusion Cosmetics brand. And this is an eyeshadow palette called Chocolates. Absolutely love this one. It's what I have on right now and I think it looks very natural. I am very impressed with this entire Perfusion line. I have another palette that I got from Walmart that has the eyeshadows and the blushes, but this one is just lovely as well. And all of these Profusion palettes come with a brush and they're actually very, very good brushes. I would put these up against my high-end makeup brushes. They're wonderful. And I am often a high-end girl in shadows, but I have found that this entire Profusion line is just absolutely wonderful. And to me, I can put it up against any high-end brand and I really like the Profusion just as well or better. Now on my eyes right now, I have this on the lid, which is a wonderful shade. Look at the glimmer and gleam in that shade. Absolutely beautiful. It's what's on my eyes. Then I have used this under the brow and it's called Gentle. And as you can tell, it's not a bright white. It's got a little bit of cream in it, which makes it look all that much more natural. And in the crease, I have this little color here called Likeable. And this is an absolutely beautiful crease shade. And as you can tell, it is not as dark as I normally go, but I am trying to do a lighter, more youthful looking makeup lately, especially with sheltering at home. And I think it just turned out absolutely lovely. I also particularly like this palette because although I think it's under $10, look at all the extra fun shades you get. I love this green, I love this burgundy shade, and then look at these fun, fun, smoky glimmers. Look at that, absolutely beautiful. I highly recommend the Profusion shadows in general and particularly this chocolate palette, especially if you like neutrals with a little bit of an option to go a little wilder. Okay, the next set of eyeshadows I'm going to show you, I absolutely adore. And these are the Laura Geller The Weekender palettes. They're face, eye, and chic palettes, and you get three of them for $27, which is amazing. And as you know, Laura Geller is a very high-end brand. This one is called Saturday Style. You get three complete palettes. The plastic is falling out there, but look at that. Absolutely beautiful, a little bit more dramatic. Got a little navy blue there, a little bit of lilac, and this beautiful, beautiful blush shade. And then look at that lovely highlighter shade. Absolutely beautiful. And it includes two more palettes. And look at that, there's Sunday Fun Day, and it says no Sunday scaries here. It's a much more natural look, and I've been using this one a lot this week, as you can tell. It creates a beautiful, very natural look. And the third palette is called Flirty Friday, and this is a little more of those rosy, kind of purpley shades that are so in right now. And the thing that I particularly like about these palettes is that you can order this for $27, which is just $9 a palette for Laura Geller eyeshadows. But the neat thing is you can choose the one that you like best. And for me, that is the natural palette. And then you have two other palettes you can give to a mother, a friend, something like that. And Mother's Day is coming. In fact, all three of these palettes would be a great Mother's Day gift for your mom. And what I've really been enjoying doing recently in these sheltering in place days is occasionally dropping by a little gift package to a friend or a family member. And I can't imagine a more wonderful gift to do that with than one of these little palettes. And I would just put it in a baggie and put a nice little note with it and stick it in your friend's front door and let them know how much you care about them. Now, something else I'm using on my eyes is this NYX Control Freak Brow Gel. And as you can see, my brows look nice and high and they don't when I forget to use this brow gel. This one from NYX is absolutely beautiful. It just has a little mascara type wand. It goes on totally clear but it does keep your brows beautifully in place. In fact, they almost feel like they have hairspray on them. Really, really love this. Now, in terms of mascara, I always wear mascara every single day, and I either like a very natural look or a very glam glam look. And I have the natural look on today, and this is my absolute favorite natural look mascara. This is the CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume, and I have it in true black, and look how it lengthens and darkens my lashes. It has an absolutely beautiful brush on it. I'm tempted to do another round. I think I, I will, real quick, because you can really layer this. And the thing I love about this mascara is it lifts and separates, as they used to say in the old Playtex bra ad, it lifts and separates. It does not give you clumps, and I really don't like clumps. I like my lashes to be long and separated and gorgeous. And this CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume, it's hard to say, 
But if you want natural lashes, but absolutely gorgeously long natural lashes, this is a fantastic mascara. Now the second mascara I absolutely love is for those times that you want a little more drama. And this is the Stila Huge Extreme Lash Mascara. And I'm tempted to put it on now. I love this mascara so much, but I probably shouldn't. It is similar to the CoverGirl in that it elongates your lashes and it doesn't make them look clumpy, which I appreciate but this one really gives you kind of a false eyelash look. And I think this unusually shaped brush is kind of one of the keys. It has very dense bristles and it kind of goes in. It almost has a little waist there, but it makes your eyelashes just very long and thick. And it really does make my lashes look like I have lash extensions on. And sometimes lately you all have been asking why my lashes look so long. And in part, it's this Stila Huge Extreme Lash, an absolutely gorgeous Glam Glam Mascara. Now, one last thing that I have on my eyes, which I really do love, and this is especially great on our sheltering at home days when we want to do almost no eye makeup, but we still don't want to have the black marks around our eyes and we want to get rid of those under eye circles that we have. This is the L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Correcting Concealer in Peach. And what Peach does, and here's a look at that color, it really blends in with your skin. It's just a nice little peach color. But many of us have those little black marks beside our nose. And I used this earlier, but maybe I'll use a little more so you can see how it works. See how it just blended in that dark mark? And then you just kind of pat it out. And I just do it on both sides. And it is just a subtle change that gets rid of those dark marks around your eyes. Absolutely love this, and I recommend it very highly. And as blush, I am wearing this Milani Baked Blush in the color Luminoso. Isn't that absolutely gorgeous? It is a peach with a subtle highlight, and it is not one of those glam glam highlights that the younger women wear. I really can't wear those. I have issues under my eyes and too many wrinkles there, and those highly illuminated blushes really just emphasize all those fine lines and wrinkles. But look at that, just a subtle peach color with just a little bit of luminosity. I guess that's why they call it Luminoso. I love the color of this, and really this is an iconic blush. Many, many YouTubers use this. This is super, super popular. Probably their most popular color in this Milani Baked Blush line. But I love the fact that you get a little bit of a very natural peach color and just a little bit of luminosity. And I love just placing it right here. I shouldn't be doing this because this is not a makeup brush. But you just put the blush on the top part of your cheekbone to give yourself a little bit of a lift. Love this. Now to sculpt under your cheekbones, I am really loving this L'Oreal Lumi Bronzet. And to me, this compares with a very, very high-end bronzer that I use, which I won't mention the name here. But the thing I like about this L'Oreal bronzer is that it is super natural and you really can't look like you're wearing chocolate bars. I have it under my cheekbones here. I have it on the side of my nose. I have it right here along my forehead to kind of narrow my rather wide forehead. But look at that. I have it in the color 01 light. And it is just a very, very subtle bronzer. And you really can't mess this up. Another place I have it is along my chin line here because we all get to be a little bit baggy and saggy, including myself. And just taking the brush and going along the chin line and right under the chin just helps to make that area look more sculpted and defined. And if you're looking for a very natural looking bronzer since summer is coming, not only can this be used to, to sculpt your cheekbones and your chin line and all of that, you can just dust it all over your face lightly and give yourself a little bit more of a tan, sun-kissed look. Absolutely love this. Now the last makeup item that I have on my face is of course my lips. And I'm absolutely loving these Maybelline Color Sensational Lip Products. I am still into the nudes. I really like them. This is the color 205 Barely There. Love that color. And I really alternate that with this color, which is 235 Warm Me Up. And as you can see, those two colors are very, very similar. One is a little bit darker than the other. I'll go ahead and reapply the 235 Warm Me Up. And as you can see, it is a natural nude, but it's a little bit darker and it does have a little bit of frostiness, which I really appreciate. And what I like to do over these rather nude lipsticks is add just a little bit of gloss in the middle. And I've been using this Maybelline New York Lip Gloss in Summer McKean. And here it is. It's an absolutely beautiful little pinky gloss. And here I'll, I'll show you how it looks. It's right there in the middle. 
smack your lips together. And look how it's just given me a little bit of glisten, a little bit of shine. It really does just pump up your lips, makes them look a little bit larger and a little bit lusher. Absolutely love this lip gloss. Now let's get into skincare. And I absolutely love skincare because none of the makeup looks good unless our skin looks its absolute best. And to me, the best way to make your skin look good is to use scientifically proven dermatologist recommended products. And that's why I'm so excited that Walmart has their dermatology recommended area. And one of the things for cleaning your skin that dermatologists recommend is the Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser. I have used this for absolute years. I have to admit that when I was in high school, I used Dove soap but I was getting very broken out because you really shouldn't use soap on your skin if you don't want to break out. But maybe in my early 20s, I started using Cetaphil and I've used it pretty much my whole life. And I think it works beautifully. This is truly a gentle cleanser and it's great for all skin types and especially sensitive skin. And then one of my most important skincare items is the CeraVe AM and PM moisturizing lotions. These I would say are the cornerstone of my skincare and I've used them both for about the past two years and they've made a huge difference in my skin. These CeraVe products both contain niacinamides, which help to brighten your skin and even your skin tone, ceramides, which help your lipid skin barrier, and also hyaluronic acid, so three wonderful skincare ingredients. This is the PM moisturizing lotion that I use at night, and this is the AM moisturizing lotion, and I particularly appreciate that it is a plus 30 SPF sunblock as well. And it does not go on heavy like most sunblocks. You don't even know the sunblock is there. But on those days when you just have a little running around to do and you forget to apply a specific sunblock, I always feel good knowing that I have the CeraVe Plus 30 on my skin to start out my day. Now, another CeraVe product that I've really been using and enjoying that is from Walmart is the CeraVe Skin Renewing Vitamin C Serum. And this is 10% pure vitamin C. And I use it every morning after I apply that moisturizer because vitamin C is an antioxidant that helps your skin fight free radicals and sun damage. And that's always very important. So if you're using a vitamin C product, I would use it in the morning. And I particularly appreciate this product. It does not go bad like many vitamin C products. And it just goes on like a little clear gel very, very soft and silky, but it does protect your skin and help your skin anti-age. And I've really been getting into vitamin C lately, so I've added a vitamin C at night. And this is in the Clean Beauty line, which is a higher-end skincare line. And this is their Vitamin C Papaya Glow Serum. And I use this one at night as the very last thing that I apply on my evening skincare because not only does the vitamin C kind of even your skin tone, but the papaya in this supposedly helps exfoliate your skin. And I haven't been using this all that long, but so far so good, I'm really liking it. It's just a nice lightweight serum. You hardly know it's there. I will report on this in the future, but so far I really am enjoying this product. And my last skincare item that I have to show you is just a little workhorse here, and I have used these for years. And these are the Equate Beauty Makeup Remover Cleansing Towelettes. Really like these for removing eye makeup or just generally removing your makeup. Really wonderful towelettes and they are of course Walmart's generic brand Equate. And I have used the Equate brand in many different products over the years with Walmart. And these are absolutely as good as their more high priced alternative. Okay, that is a look at some of my all time favorite makeup and skincare products from Walmart. And I put all the links below so you can go and check them out and see what you think about them. I think you'll really love them. Now, if you're not a subscriber, I hope you'll click that little bell and subscribe to my channel or give this video a thumbs up and or share it with a friend. Okay, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day. And normally I read from a card deck, but because this video is from Walmart, I really wanted to share a little story with you. And I have shared it in a previous Walmart video. But for those of you who didn't see that video, I just wanted to share this with you because Walmart means a lot to me because number one, it helps me save money, which I really appreciate. And in retirement, all of us are living on a more streamlined budget, shall we say. And so that's really important. That cost savings feature is really good. But the second reason I really appreciate Walmart is a personal one. And it goes back about 20 years. My parents are both psychologists and they had started a company called Preferred Mental Health Management or PMHM. And PMHM's job was to help employers save money on mental health and substance abuse care 
actually by improving mental health care, and I won't get into that, but I did sell their product for many years, and the largest sale I made was to National Walmart. And it was amazing because at the time Walmart selected us to be their behavioral vendor, we were a very small company. In fact, my parents were both still in private practice, still seeing patients, and we had just started this company maybe three years before and had maybe a handful of clients at that point. But we went to Walmart and showed them what we had to offer and they believed in us and they gave our small company a chance. And I have to say that many other large companies wouldn't even have meetings with us. And the fact that Walmart allowed us to meet with them and share what we had with them and that they even selected us as their behavioral vendor, and we were their vendor for 10 years, 10 wonderful years. That was really something that enriched our family and helped that company really grow and thrive because the minute Walmart started using us, that gave us the seal of approval, so other companies decided to use us as well. I really will never forget that Walmart took a chance on PMHM. It was great for my parents' company, and then my sister and I ended up starting another kind of similar benefits company after that experience working with Walmart for 10 years. So not only does Walmart enrich my beauty and skincare life, it's actually enriched the life of my entire family. So with that, I will let you go, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video.